Okay, before I get this video started, um, I feel like you guys should understand. Yesterday, I wasn't tough. I wasn't thinking about filming anything because I had nothing planned. There was nothing working out. Then Francis texted me, "Hey, we're celebrating your birthday today," and that's where the story takes off. I'm sorry if this vlog is a little more jumbled than it usually was. Honestly, this was completely off the whim, and we had no idea what we were doing. Hope you enjoy it, though. Thanks, guys. Bye. <laughs> Hey guys, so uh, I just finished work. It is currently like 8 o'clock and Francis decided to pick me up and we're gonna randomly go celebrate my birthday. Oh, well, like, we're gonna have dinner. My birthday is actually not until Sunday, but he's busy the day I'm celebrating it. And when I texted him, he just was like, we're just celebrating today. So now we're heading to my place to grab some money and then we're gonna head to Jasmine's place to pick her up and then we're also gonna head to Gary's place to pick her up. So yeah, it's gonna be interesting. See you guys. Okay, so I just got my my wallet. Um, I'm kinda like we're now we're gonna to go, go we're crashing Jasmine's place to grab her. So yeah, yeah like I'm see you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so I'll be honest with you. This was completely last minute. This is so last minute. So we just randomly called up Jasmine. Uh, we randomly called up my friend Gary. So now we're randomly going to a random restaurant, super last minute and everyone's pretty mad because they have to get ready. Uh, we're picking up Jasmine last because she takes the longest time to get ready. We're going out for gas right now and then we're going to Gary's place to pick him up and he, was like blindsided by this entire thing. Trust me, I was blindsided too. I'll see you guys in a bit. Enjoy this montage. <laughs> okay, let me get this straight. A lot of you guys aren't gonna see Francis because he doesn't want to put his face on his videos, which is understandable. But I think the best way to describe him is that he's just a bro. Like we're talking about like a five foot four guy that lifts, eats nothing but meat and protein and drives his CRV like it's a Lamborghini. So yeah, that's the best way to describe Francis. You won't see him, but you can imagine him. See you guys. Yeah. Hey guys, so uh, you probably can't see me because it's like, it's nighttime right now and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. But we finally picked up Gary. Say hi. What's up? You can't see him. <laughs> I'll show you a better clip of him. Gary, do you agree with me? This was super last minute. Yeah, pretty much. Yep, this was super last minute. Ow. Francis just hit me. Now we're going to go to the bank because Jasmine still needs to get ready. We're going to go to the bank. I need to deposit some money and all that so I have money to blow tonight. Bye, guys. <laughs> Okay, so now we're at, yeah, it's cool. Lighting, look at that, lighting. Okay, so now we're at front in front of Jasmine's house and she just texted me. She said that she was in the shower and I don't know how long girls take when it comes to the shower, apparently a long time. So now we're just waiting in her driveway. Are you excited, Gary? Yep. You don't sound excited. <laughs> Oh no, I'm just daydreaming. Okay. Wait, but it's night. Does that consider night dreaming? Night dreaming. <laughs> it's called. It's just. It's just regular dreaming. So Francis recommended this place called Big Teas, and apparently for like thirty bucks each of us, we can get this entire platter of just meat. It doesn't sound good, but apparently it's amazing, and apparently a whole bunch of like lifters eat it too. So I'll see you guys in a bit. We'll probably be in the restaurant the next time I bring out. I bring you guys out. So yeah. See you guys. Bye. <laughs> so we made some changes. Uh, Big T. Instead of going to Big T, we're going to this Chinese joint in downtown. The reason why we're not going to Big T is because 
Um, Big T closes at 10. And if you ever worked in food service, you know how rude it is to go in there the last hour. Yeah, we went there to hum days at like 8 and it closed at 9. Were they just like staring at you? We were still done food. Okay, well, like, we don't want to be rude and apparently we're going to eat this really big platter that takes forever to finish. So instead, we're going to go down to Chinatown, eat some things there, eat this thing called cheesy chicken rice. It sounds disgusting, but tastes amazing. Gary can vouch for it. Baked rice, yeah. Baked rice, apparently, that's what he... Why are you cleaning your windshield? Stop, stop. It's not raining. <laughs> okay, bye guys. Did anyone, anyone want to do it? Okay, so we are now in downtown Calgary, as you can see. Hi guys. Francis doesn't want to be in my shot again. He's on the other side of the camera. He just fingered me. <laughs> so yeah, now we're in downtown. We're going to hit this place right here called Calgary Court Restaurant. Shouting you out right now. There you go. Oh, really focus. There you are. So we're going to go in here, eat some food have some good times. I'll like definitely vlog the food this time rather than just give a quick snippet. Or probably just give a quick snippet. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye guys. Hey guys, so uh, we just finished eating Chinese food. It is currently like 10.26 or 10.20. No. And now we're going for bubble tea because apparently there's a bubble tea place that's still open. I guess those- Where's Gary? Did he die? We lost Gary. Gary died! Okay. Gary's getting a lollipop. Also, apparently this restaurant has a haunted ha washroom. So if you want to see some ghosts and some spooky things for Halloween, come to this restaurant. Yeah, I got a lollipop. <laughs> Okay, so now we're going to quick see you in a bit guys. Bye. <laughs> you wanna cover it? So we're at quickly right now. With a quickly expert. With a quickly expert. <laughs> see we have Gary here. Yeah, so a quickly expert. Okay, so basically quickly is this really popular bubble tea joint. Well at least one of the more popular pop bubble tea joints here in Calgary. Um and yeah, we have like this entire menu full of just bubble tea stuff. I would recommend the real fruit slush or perhaps the milk tea is cold of course. Okay, you heard that here folks. The slush and the milk tea cold, not warm. Fruit slush. Fruit slush. Fruit. Write that down. After bubble tea we're gonna be heading home considering it's like a Tuesday night and everyone else has school except for me and Francis. <laughs> Hi guys, so it is currently 11 o'clock. So this was basically my birthday dinner, even though I have another one on Friday and I have another one on Sunday. Saturday. Saturday. And then I want to do something with you on Sunday. Yeah. Mr. Popular. <laughs> Ignore that. You probably can't see me. But uh, yeah, I think this is it for the night because I won't be able to record at home because my, my parents will be sleeping and my family will be sleeping. So yeah, uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. Subscribe if you like it, like this video, and also thank you for the support. I currently have 27 subscribers in less than a week, and that's quite a bit actually. So yeah, see you guys. Bye! Bye! Bye.